Alright folks, that's my tent set up, this is me at Stincher Bridge We're here for three nights There's uh, quite a crew us now, we've just put a fire up and we've set up operations We've got our tents up, I came here straight from my work so I did uh, So, I've got uh, again the foil The foil blanket here underneath and I've got my Snug, uh, sorry, my poncho liner on the floor again And then I've got my sleep mat there which is a static with static V, Thinchelite static V mat Then I've got my Arctic sleeping bag And then I've got my uh, under blanket from a DD hammock to put on top to catch any condensation So I have, uh, that's my clays because we're camping quite close to the car I've got my double cooker here which I've not used yet Got the gas in there, other utensils And this is a present for Tommy Brennan Thank you very much Tommy And he's given me another box down there So we're not getting a new cappuccinos And I'd actually forgot to bring the cappuccinos So Tommy, you're a wee dream Excellent So I'll show you where we are Let's come out We are in the middle of the forest And we're at Stincher Bridge Glen, his camp is there And he... The Scottish Wanderer is over there somewhere, he's up there The Scottish Wanderer's tent's up there, you can maybe see the wee flash So you can, his guidelines Let's close this up and tuck it into the tent Let's close this up and tuck it into the fire You can see that's Mark McFarlane's tarp there they went and brought Which is good This is my tarp I went and brought here, they're just sort of old ones That we've got right across And this is my windbreaker I've used for the first time That we've got right along here And this is with fire. Here's Glenn. Hey folks. Glenn for YouTube. And here's Prophecy Prepper. Hey. He's with lights maybe dazzling here a wee bit. There's Prophecy, first time we've met him, sure it is. And here's sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting this around, getting mixed up here. Here's Mark Prophecy Prepper. Oh. And here's Stuart the Scottish Wanderer. Now I've got it right. And there's Mark McFarlane. There's too many marks here. <laughs> We're getting chilly tonight. <laughs> Shit, the famous dance. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> Magic. Here's Jed. Here's Jed, and here's George. This is the Friday night crew, so it is. The Friday night crew. Well, there's the back of George. And Tommy Brennan just actually went home because uh, he's not feeling very well, so hopefully he's coming back tomorrow. But he's very kindly left us a great big pot of chilli. Has he? Aye, left a big pot of chilli for us and some naan bread. Now I borrowed this chair for the allotment, so I promise I'll bring it back <laughs> from the allotment. And now for a couple of cans of Heineken. Desperado! Desperado! Prophecy Pepper gave me, he wanted a Heineken! I don't know if it was a good trade or not! <laughs> In Chile! See, with that, with that flame shining on my face, that camera will pick, pick it up. No, no, no. We're having fun around the fire, Friday night. We've still got Saturday night and Sunday night. More people coming later on. Peter Mad Dog Bushcraft's coming at 2 o'clock in the morning, then tomorrow it'll be Sinclair. And uh, I think Julie can make it, but Gamfer Arach is coming, and whoever else. The chilli con carne is getting heated up. Right guys, we've got a big pot of chilli there. You can see it over there that Tommy Brennan went and made. Now he's away home, not feeling very well, but he's went and left it for us, so we've got it heated up. And this is what it looks like here. Magic. And we've got some numb bread as well. So we've just got to get tucked into this. On a Friday night. Lovely. Everybody's getting tucked in. George is away at his bed and we're just having a nice wee fire. Friday night's chill. We've had a nice chilli con carne, is that what it was? A chilli con carne? A chilli or something, it was really nice. There's the pot, there's still quite a lot left for the morning's night, aye. You've got quite a lot of it. That was full, that. It's still steaming. We're ready for a second. We've got our own tub back. We've had a wee bit of beer, not much. A couple of cans. Here it is. You've got to have the pasta whiskey. 
Hopefully we'll get Sinclair here in the morning and we'll pass a wee bit more around. <laughs> All right. And Stuart doesn't have drink, so I've been drinking Stuart's. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, yes. All right. That's good Almost stuff. <laughs> Anybody else want some? No, I'm fine. I'll eat one. Fill my cup then. I'll kill my stomach. That is nice. Cheers. There's Mark Prophecy Prepper gun for some. Cheers, all the best. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> Whee! Still going strong. <laughs> oh, I've burnt my head off. For Glen sleeping, my wee home, the Scottish wanderer is up through the trees there. His tent's quite well camouflaged. That's Tommy Brennan's setup. But as I say, he had to go home last night because he wasn't feeling well, and he travels quite a distance away. But if he said he might come back the day, but if he doesn't, he will gather up his gear and take it away. Now you'll see this rubbish here we've collected. This is what was left here when we got here for some other people. Now what I'll do is I'll take that away with me, all of that rubbish there. That's no ours, but we'll take it away. That's disgusting. That's Jed's set up. Nice we set up his hammock. All right, come down, come down. <laughs> come on, all of you. Come on. It's a scouser, run. <laughs> and here's the crew for last night. There's Jed, Mark Prophecy Prepper. Stuart Scottish Wanderer, Mark McFarlane out in the wild, yep. and we've got George, Wakey George Bus Pass Camper, and we've got Glenn for South West Wilderness, and of course you've got Marcel, the Densome Ranger. Lovely jubbly. That was the crew for last night, we'll see who's got to turn up today. Is Pete's car here, no? Well, we've got this up Pete's van, I know. Has he got a new old van? I don't know. Did he clock this morning? That's Mark McFarlane's tent. That's a North Face, the North Face, Heyerdahl, whatever, I don't know, too. Heyerdahl, not sure, not sure. Of course, this is Mark Prophecy Preppers. I can't mind what you call that one, but you heard it at what? Camp in the Mines, oh, here we go. Wild Country. Helm 2, the Terra Nova, Terra Nova Helm 2. Mm -hmm. Of course, over here is Wicked George's tent. The Southern Cross 2 as well. Aye. Colombian coffee! Oh yes, I love some of that. Yeah, definitely. Oh, aye. I'm going to make some now. Aye. I've got the plunger there. I'll get my cup. Here's Peter, Mad Dog Bushcraft. How's it going, my man? Thanks for that. Here. <laughs> I, think he got, I think he got lost. I did get lost a little bit. We came here and I thought, the first thing I said to him was, I said, that signs away. I said, Pete might, might not see you because that signs away. Well, I'm going to have Jed's making a coffee. A coffee, I'm just letting that do its thing. And then I'm going to have a wee quiche here. Ooh. A wikis? Lovely. Very sophisticated. Very sophisticated. <laughs> Filtered coffee. 
So cheers everybody. I'm gonna have my coffee and a quiche. Quiche. Come here, I'll give you a quiche. Oh. Oh. George has got to give me a quiche after. <laughs> He's not got his teeth in. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having great fun doing there. I'm getting offered coffee, bacon rolls, and everything. <laughs> I've just got to get you in shortly. I've got a toilet and come back, didn't you? Get you in. Oh, look at that magic. Aye, that's what I'm having as well. Aye. You bacon rolls, did it? This is what this is what camping's all about. <laughs> <laughs> and the cooking competition begins. <laughs> this is us just took the wee out and the rest of them are way up Connie's Hill. And uh, we've came to Loch Braddon so we can take a couple of photographs, so we'll just chuck you along there. The dam. So there's trout in here. Is it permitted this bit? Aye, aye. aye. You've got to get a ticket for the lock of brands. I think, I don't know. Don't we'll try this at home, folks. Then some danger. Looks like ice cream. <laughs> First time trying a wee double cooker that I went and got for go outdoors and it'll work a treat. I don't know what I'm going to have yet. I've got MREs in there boiling the bag, so I'll have a look through and see what I've brought. And of course I'm going to be having a cappuccino, thanks to Tommy Brennan that went and gave me them. Cheers Tom. Sirloin. Oh, sirloin steak. On the firebox. Oh, magic, magic. Oh, mushrooms. I'll be picking up some of that while you're cooking it. Yeah. We'll be having a look at that. Yeah. Bacon and beans and tomato sauce. And chicken and sweet and sour pasta. <laughs> some combination. Oh, and I'm getting ready for my cappuccino. Kettle's boiling.
country code. This rubbish here was what people went and left for previous times and we're cleaning it up and taking it away. This is disgraceful. Take your rubbish away and it's only the idiots that leave the rubbish. Absolutely no need for it. And I've got no qualms in saying that, I don't care what anybody says. It's ridiculous. I mean that's just all broken glass. Aye. The amount of wildlife that must come through here. Yep. And how long is that going to take us to clean up? No long with a spade and a shovel and we take it away. By the time we leave this place here, it'll be spotless. It'll be a lot, we always leave it a lot better than what we came. Here we go. That pile there is now in there and it wasn't hard today. No. Nope. Wasn't hard today. Yeah, Remember other people use them woods and kids aye. not come in here. Kids, and aye. Wildlife and their dogs. broken glass. Cats, yeah, dogs. Cats and dogs. Yep. No Good though. Good job well done. But we'll I'm take that home and we'll get it dumped. Excellent. The whiskey's getting past the news, so the Baileys has got to be passed away on IG shortly. And because there's 10 or 11 of us, we're not getting drunk out, we're just socialising because by the time you pass it around, there's uh, not much left out of all. <laughs> but we can feel the heat off the fire now. Tomorrow night, this is Saturday night, tomorrow night, Sunday, is to be really cold at night time, but that's when we're going to have our biggest fire. Some of the crew are got to leave us tomorrow, uh, but there'll be about four or five of us, and hopefully Michelle and Spike. I've got to come and join us uh, in Young Owen. And we'll have a good Sunday night, so we will. But we're warm the now, really warm. It's great. We're having a wee beer. Some of us are having some wine, a wee bit of whiskey. Magic. Alright, Terry. It's a scouser! <laughs> come down, come down! <laughs> Mark McFarlane. Jed, it was just there with the scouser wig on. We've got Sinclair, Pathfinder Smith. We've got Mark Prophecy Prepper. We've got. Yes, he gets his ass out the way. We've got Peter Mad Dog Bushcraft. We've got Stuart, the Scottish Wanderer. We've got Glenn, Southwest Wilderness. And we've got Colin. Has Colin got a YouTube channel? No, right. We've got Colin. That camps too much in the Galloway Forest. <laughs> I thought you said your name was Stuart. You were after. You've got me. The uh, handsome stranger, the, the, handsome stranger. the densome <laughs> ranger, and uh, the person that's missing is the wakey George, the bus pass camper, but he'll be here just shortly. <laughs> Having fun. D-I-A-C-O. Come on, Derek, you're the dancer. Oh, you're doing pretty well. You know what, I've got the van, I'm sure I've got some stuff in the van. I've got it here, I just... Guys, it's Bailey's time. It's Bailey time. Get a shake. Get the whiskey mixed in. And get the cup. You got your cup ready, Mark? I'll get a cup, eh? Right, this is for Jolish. She's a bit daddy, Jolish, so I want you to sing. I'll sing. Is my cup lying about here? Ready? Right, George, what would you say? We've got a bit of whiskey in it, just to buy extra strength. Yeah, 
Cheers, everybody. Cheers, folks. Hey, hey, hey. Bailey's in a wee bit of bourbon. Perfect. Eddie. Cheers, mate. Shame you're not right. here. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's nice. Oh. Right. Hey. Hey. Oh. Hey. Hey. Ah, oh, Link! That's, that's what happens when you come out in the wood! Loud and clear, loud and clear! Receiving, receiving! What is your message? <laughs> what is the smoke situation over that side? <laughs> ah, we're going to swear, but I'm better not. <laughs> See you. Woo -hoo. Do it again, do it again. Do it. Are they talking? We're all right, you're all right. Come down, come down. Calm down, calm down. Yeah, what did you say to me, mate? Oh, man. I got it wrong again, didn't I? Just let me get into it. Give me a minute. You look like you mean Eddie Murphy. So Alright, mate. Alright. No, I'm not alright. You alright? Calm down, calm down, calm down. Did you do, don't, 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 <laughs> I'm all steamed up, aren't you? Wesley Snipes! Is it me, boy? No, no, that one. <laughs> <laughs> Who's well with the mask? Eat your man bastard! You're a fucking man! <laughs> I've got the moose! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, all you need is just thrust it in there. I think Stuart needs to do the spam dance with the arrow. Aye. Aye, the spam dance with the horse he done. You don't come to cook, father. You've got to get this in the bed. You do, don't you? You do, don't you? Yeah, they do. No, they don't. Yeah, they do. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down.